Welcome to the Nissan Cafe at worshiptogether.com. Today we have Ben Canalon with us sharing his song, Remain. We hope you enjoy this Nissan Cafe. Ben, great to have you, man. Good to be here, man. It's not often we get you over here, and it's, uh, it's always a, an honor and a privilege. No, man, thanks for having me. It's great to be here. Uh, we're going to be looking at a song today uh, called Remain, um, which was um, really cool. Starfield ended up recording this. Yeah. Um, you've done a version as well. Yeah. Um, but talk a little bit about uh, where the song came from. It's a really interesting title. Yeah. Well, I mean, <clears throat> I think, um, yeah, being over in the UK, I was, I'm originally from Canada. Uh, you probably can't tell it from my accent's a bit messed up now. I'm <laughs> sounding Canadian kind of, slash yeah, English. Yeah, English weird <laughs> thing. So uh, some people say I'm Irish, some people say I'm Australian or South African. I don't know. Anyways, but I, I've kind of been over in the UK for s almost seven years now. Mm -hmm. And um, when I first moved, uh, you know, I, I just sort of, again, was writing songs and trying to write, you know, songs for church and stuff. And, and out of my experience of moving, you know, kind of, I left all my family and friends and just sort of started this new adventure in, in the UK. And and I, I don't know, I just, this, this song was really a personal f song f of response to what God was sort of doing, you know, taking me from somewhere where I was sort of, you know, just comfortable, you know, and, and then moving into somewhere that's not comfortable and having yeah. to adjust and go through different things. And, and, um, and so, you know, the verses are really kind of just a real personal thing, you know, defender of this heart, you love me from the start, you never change. And I just wanted to capture, you know, that idea, you know, I love the word Emmanuel, and that means, you know, God with us. And, and just that sort of thing of, you know, whatever we go through, you know, He remains, you know, He remains the same, you know, yesterday, today, and forever. And I think just that word remain is just such mm. a, a, a strong sort of word that, that is, um, says so much in it. So I wanted to kind of capture that. And yeah, so that's kind of how it came about. Yeah, man. Well, play it for us. We'd love okay. to Defender of this heart, you love me from the start. You never change. Through the highs and lows, as seasons come and go, you never fail. Day after day. victorious you are strong and mighty to say for your word stands true there is none like you and when all else fades you remain when troubles come my way you guide and you sustain lead me I pray Yeah, 
and you're playing some really unique chords yeah. there. I was, I, at first, I was watching you. I'm like, I, I, okay, yeah, what key it. is he in? Uh -huh. But um, you're actually in the you're in the key of D. But yeah. capo, you're playing it in like yeah. some C configurations. Yeah. But, man, walk us through. I love the open chords and yeah. stuff. Yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, I find that yeah, it's just easier to sort of walk around the chords because they move a lot around in the chorus and stuff. But um, so in the verse, just C, and I kind of. Instead of playing the full C, I, I, I mute this, that one a bit. Yeah, it's like a it's C sounds, over a G or yeah. something like that, yeah. Yeah, exactly. It just sounds a bit more cleaner. And, and, um, I don't know. Uh, so C, and then I just sort of walk down, Defender of the Star, you love me from the start. A minor, you never change. And then back to, uh, then to F, I guess. And you're, you're grabbing the F. And I hate it because I can't, I can't I know, do that. Like, yeah. some guys are good at doing that, but I you're grabbing the, uh, like, get on the grabbing the F note with your thumb. Yeah. <laughs> so, I mean, I, I just, I and I like to kind of keep it that way because then you just, you, you don't have to kind of, you don't have to move around too yeah. much, you know? You play the F that way. Right. But you just, you, you, I don't know, that's why. And you've got an, that's an F, but you've got an open G, and you're also grabbing mm -hmm. uh, the relative G with your pinky as well. So, yeah, yeah that's a great sound chord. So it just really keeps it open, yeah, like you said. Yeah. And so that's basically the chorus, or the verse um, chords, is like C, walks down. And then the pre-chorus, day after day, is just stays on that F, which is a G chord, basically, and then back to D. And then A, in a G shape, and B minor, in an A minor shape. So it's basically yeah. kind of just a different shape. Faithful and true you are. And then you hold that. The chorus is just you go to um, F, and this is where I kind of like kind of move it around. But I go F, E over C, then G. So just kind of instead of having to do it in like in D shape, it's just easier for me to move around that way. Yeah, and you're on those on the C chords you're playing, you're you're letting that top string open, which yeah. is kind of a C over E yes. chord there. Yeah, the whole sort an of inverted chord. So. So I try, I try and keep it simple because yeah, it moves around a lot, but it just, it fills it out, you know. Yeah. So, man, cool. Yeah. Really great sounds, man. We appreciate you coming by. Pleasure, man. Thanks for having me.